welcome back to the daily update from the Wayne County Sheriff's Office. I'm Captain Doug Hunter coming to you today on February the 1st, 2016. First of all, good job to a man who observed something out of the norm last night in Wayne Township. You see the man observed a small child riding a bicycle at around 11 p.m. It turned out to be a nine-year-old girl who was in the process of running away from home. See the girl apparently snuck out of the house while under the care of a babysitter. So deputies responded uh, to the scene, investigated, uh, got the girl back home, made contact with the mother and all as well. But uh, good job for, for this man for seeing something out of the norm and taking time to actually care. Now also last night, deputies arrested a woman in East Union Township. They would responded to the residence on two separate occasions. It seemed that the woman was intoxicated. Uh, she had burnt some furniture out in the front yard of the home and was creating a disturbance with the neighbors. It was a trailer park situation, so there were neighbors all around and she seemed to be disruptive with everybody in the neighborhood, so she earned herself a ride to jail. Now, CVS Pharmacy today announced that they will soon be providing Narcan or Naloxone to family members of people that are addicted to heroin. And as you may know, Naloxone is the heroin overdose antidote. Uh, it's a nasal spray, uh, can be used when suspecting a heroin overdose and it can reverse the effects of this and it is a life-saving drug. It's very important to use this drug in a suspected heroin overdose. It actually does mean the difference between life and death. Now some people are saying, well, you know, if, if they use heroin, that's what they get. Hey folks, it's about saving lives. That's exactly why law enforcement in Wayne County, every law enforcement agency in Wayne County, I'm proud to say, carries Narcan because we are interested in saving the lives. Yes, we know people sometimes make bad decisions, sometimes people get addicted to drugs, but we are in the life-saving business. And now the fact, the fact is Narcan will be available to members of the general public. So we're hopeful that families of individuals who are addicted will take advantage of this situation. We hope that they never have the opportunity to use it, but if they're faced with the opportunity to save a life of a loved one, this will allow them to have the tools to do just that. Now, we would much rather people not be involved with heroin or any other illegal drugs, but this provides a life-saving tool, and I, I see this as a really big deal for families of those that are addicted. So that's what we have for today. Until next time, please stay safe.